Today I'm going to answer a common question I often get. How to convert a PDF file into a Word document so I can edit it. Now there are plenty of solutions and converters out there, but I'm going to show you a proven solution that will work. All you need is Microsoft Word in a desktop version. Anything starting from Word 2013 and later will do. It's super simple. So let's say you have this PDF document here, which you want to edit and make some changes to. All you have to do is open Microsoft Word, click on open, and then browse for your file. In my case, I have it right here because I pinned it before. Alternatively, you can also just drag it here. Then Word will convert the document. You'll get this message informing you that depending on the size of the document, this could take a while and that the result might not look exactly like the original PDF. Just click on OK and that's it. It did an excellent job converting the text and even most of the formatting is like it was in the original PDF. So that's it. Simple as that. Now I can edit the document as I like and I can resave it as PDF if I need to. When you use this conversion, you'll find that the results could vary. Sometimes the quality of the conversion will be almost perfect, like in my example, but sometimes it will be off to some degree. Now, the main reason for that will probably be the difference between a true or native PDF document versus a scanned PDF. A native PDF is a vector-based file that was created from an electronic document and saved as a PDF. It contains electronic code, and so converting such a PDF file to a Word document will give you the best results. Now, on the other hand, a scanned PDF is a raster-based file without any electronic code. For example, here, I have the exact same contract as a PDF, but this time I printed it out and then scanned it as PDF. Scanning essentially results in an image as if you took a photo of it with your phone. When you convert such a PDF to Word, the result is not going to be perfect. Let's try to convert this printed and scanned version to Word. Click on OK, and here it is. You see, it didn't pick up the bold formatting here, and sometimes the font size is off, and the numbering in some cases needs some editing. But the conversion of the text is the same as in the native PDF example. As you can see, the conversion for both native and scanned PDF was generally easy and fast too. For the native conversion, the outcome was almost perfect. If you have a scanned PDF, the result will depend on the quality of the printout and the quality of the scan. And generally, formatting and graphics will not convert well. In case you have images that you want to convert into Word or Excel, check out this video, which shows you how you can easily do it with just your phone and a free app. I hope you found today's video helpful. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and do consider subscribing if you aren't subscribed to this channel. I'll see you in the next video.